Yo, what is up guys? I just finished the Turkey Day event early and I'm here to give you guys all the juicy stuff on how to complete the event fast and easy. Took me like 15 minutes to actually complete the event. If you've done this event last year, um, there is a new thing, right? There is something new that we will be getting that we didn't get last year. But other than that, it's kind of the same. Uh, you're still delivering food for Franklin. Um, and if you don't have the food that you need, you can check in with your villagers and they'll give you the food, right? So the first uh, recipe that you need to get for Franklin is the clam chowder recipe, which requires three clams, right? And you can get these clams um, digging up uh, little star things on your island. I don't know what you call them. I'm just gonna call them star things. <laughs> Uh, so that one's pretty easy and you'll get like a turkey day rug after that, right? Uh, the next one the next recipe that you get for Franklin is a pumpkin pie recipe, right? It takes one orange pumpkin and now this may be different for everybody else uh, He told me to get him a green pumpkin. All right, so one orange one green is what I'm gonna go with And then once you do that for Franklin, he'll give you a turkey day wall, right? now the now the next recipe is called the gratin recipe, right? That requires uh, a flat mushroom and get this, right? He told me to get him a carrot, right? A brand new crop, brand new food, you know? So that, that was pretty awesome, right? Because it's something new. Now this could be different for everybody. I don't know, but this is just my experience. And then after that, he'll give you the turkey day flooring, all right? Now the final recipe that you have to get for Franklin is like a fish recipe, right? Um, I'm not gonna say the, the name because I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> but anyway, it requires one sea bass and one dab. At least that's what it required for me, all right? Now I didn't have these fishes, so what I did was I had to go check in my villagers and have them give it to me, right? So I had a horse mackerel already on me and Cube's like, yo, I see you got a horse mackerel. I need that horse mackerel. Give me your horse mackerel and I'll give you a sea bass, all right? So we had a little exchange. Uh, Franklin needed the sea bass and I'm, so I got the sea bass from Cube. And then I went over and talked to Goldie and who would have known? Goldie also needed a horse mackerel, right? So I went ahead and I got my fishing pole out and I went and I, went fishing right and get this the first try i caught a horse mackerel i was like no way i got that on the first exact try and i went ahead and i gave it to goldie and goldie gave me the final ingredient which was the dab and then i went ahead and i gave the dab and the sea bass to franklin franklin's like yeah boy we got everything we need let's get cooking and then here's where it gets interesting, okay? So the final reward, all right? Now, spoiler alert, all right? If you don't mean to spoil it for you, you might wanna click off the video. But the final reward was new recipes, all right? So let me pull up these new recipes for you. So we actually unlocked the recipes that we we're supposed to get for Franklin, okay? So we unlocked the clam chowder, the pumpkin pie, uh, the gratin, and uh the fish recipe right so all the recipes that we got for franklin we unlock them after the event now you don't necessarily have to do the event to unlock these franklin actually told me after i was gathering all the recipes for him that um these recipes will be unlocked at the nook's cranny uh the day after the event right um, if you do the event for Franklin, you just unlock them at, at sooner, right? He says he gives it to you at advance, so you just get it sooner. But um, yeah, guys, I'll catch you later.